Hello guys, I'll be showing you guys how to make creamy carbonara ramen. So I got my ramen here. I cooked the three, I cooked three packs. I, I drained all the water. I strained all the water. Got my bowl, chopsticks. Got the sauces it came with, and I opened the the powder sauce. And I have my parmesan cheese. My parmesan, my craft parmesan cheese. Any parmesan cheese. This is honestly optional. This is optional. Honestly, all you need is heavy cream or milk. Heavy cream or milk works. All right, so we got we gotta start adding our powder and sauces. There's one. All right, I forgot this important step. Cook your um cook your thing on like medium low heat, the heavy cream or milk to um to heat it up. Add yeah, the sauces now. I do this way faster if I didn't have a camera, but I'm handicapped because I only have one hand, unfortunately. I'm just gonna pause it. All right. Oh my god, now I'm using two hands, bro. This is gonna take too much work for one hand. But just to just for the show, use it one hand for now. <laughs> After it heats up in the first place, I suggest to put it on low. Yeah, because it's already heated up. And now you get yourself some Parmesan cheese. This is optional, but it makes it better, right? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Doesn't hurt if you already have it. Unless you're trying to cook like some pasta. Fettuccino fest. Fettuccino ferro pasta. All right. Put a little bit more. It's like a little bit more. One last time. All right. That's good. All right. Now look at that creamy, creamy pasta. I mean, creamy sauce we're making. All right. So we're thickening it right now. Um, make it delicious, creamy for the noodles. These noodles. Make sure you under. I am I. I recommend undercooking these a little bit because this is gonna heat up and it's gonna cook it more. And if you like it al dente, definitely undercook the noodles whenever. If you're boiling them, make sure you, um, what's it called? Take them off the heat the moment they start separating from each other. Like the strands start separating. Immediately take it off. All right, guys, it's thick enough now. Let's pour the noodles in and mix it all together. Oh, shit. It's gonna clump. Oh, oh shit. Yeah. <laughs> all right. Oh, shit, shit, shit. It hardened up. Uh, here's the here's a little masterpiece guys. This is it. I'm gonna take a picture for the thumbnail. Boom boom. And now let's give this a try. Cheers guys. Cheers. Get a small bite. Here you go. Test it, test it out. Creamy and delicious. Oh yeah. Yeah yeah, way creamier. But honestly. For the amount of effort, I would probably make it more, uh, just make it normal style without the heavy uh, heavy cream and the Parmesan and this extra pan, more dishes. Just a simple pot and bowl would be sufficient enough for me. But this is really good. Like, I feel like you guys should try this at least once and see what you prefer. This also makes it less spicy than it usually is. But uh, yeah, guys, this is it for video. Consider liking and subscribing. As always, guys, peace out. Rate us 10 out of 10. What eat again? It's not exactly al dente, but... I mean, what can you do?